Databases. As a nursing student, you will need to use a number of databases to find information for your studies. While Google is effective in finding government information and popular health sites, you will often need more specialized resources to efficiently find scholarly and professional materials. The USC Upstate Library provides access to several core nursing databases that give access to the professional nursing literature, research and recommendations for evidence-based practice, and reference books. Searching databases is different than searching Google. On the web, search engines like Google typically find your keywords in the titles, URLs, and most importantly, the full text of web pages. Databases like CINAHL Complete, which we will look at shortly, have origins stretching back long before the web. They are made up of records, shorter descriptions of items that contain only the most essential information. When you search, your words are matched against words in these records. Not everything in most databases is available in full text, so even when present, full text is not usually searched by default. Here is an example of a record in CINAHL. Note that it is divided into a number of fields with specific information. Title, authors, source, publication type, language, minor and major subjects, etc. Each of these fields is searchable, which is a powerful way to find specific information like a particular article or works by a particular author. Databases are programmed to understand certain relationships between words connected with and, or, or not. Use and to connect two search terms representing distinct concepts. In your search, you will only retrieve records with both terms. Use OR to connect terms that are synonymous or are related. In your search, OR will retrieve all records with the first term, second term, and both terms. Use NOT to exclude the second term. Be careful with NOT, as you could inadvertently omit relevant records from your search but it can be useful on occasion. A good rule of thumb for effective database searching, therefore, is to use two to three good keywords from your topic and to connect them with and, or, or not as appropriate. Let's take a closer look at CINAHL Complete. Did you know that CINAHL stands for Cumulative Index to Nursing and Allied Health Literature? It is one of the most comprehensive databases for scholarly, peer-reviewed journals in nursing and allied fields, providing citations, abstracts, and frequently the full text of articles. It also covers several other kinds of sources, professional non-peer-reviewed journals, book chapters, dissertations and theses, pamphlets, conference proceedings, a series of evidence-based care sheets, and more. Let's try a search. We will be looking for articles about Sister Calista Roy, a nun and nurse theorist who teaches at Boston College, and her influential theory, the Roy Adaptation Model. Note that the advanced search screen for CINAHL allows you to organize your search in three boxes, choose appropriate connectors, and even specify a field to search. There are two ways I can go about this search. Look for information on the nurse theorist or look for information on the theory. But our OR connector means we can look for both at the same time. So for example, put her name in the first search box. Make sure that you've selected OR and then the name of the theory. You can also find ways to limit your search under search options. Unless I'm looking for something very specific, however, I like to start with a broad search and then narrow down the results. So let's see what comes up. We have over 1,000 results. Note that the second is in Spanish. CINAHL is international in scope. Also note that articles range in date back to 1976 and that there are several different source types. Now is a good time to refine this list. First, let's limit the date range to the last five years. 
We are now down to 123 results. Click on Show More under the date range to see more options. Apply Related Words is useful as it will expand your search to related words identified by the database. Let's also check peer-reviewed for scholarly articles, English language. If you want articles by nurses, check any author's nurse. And if you want to limit to just nursing journals, you can choose nursing under journal subset. So let's see what happens now. This search yielded seven results. If you want to see the most recent articles at the top of your results, go to Relevance and select Date Newest. Click on any title to see the database record for that item. Links to full text will be on the upper left side, and there are several useful tools on the right. You will usually find an abstract, a summary of the article, which you should read to see if the article is relevant to your needs, and a list of major and minor subjects. Major subjects are indexing terms in the database, and by clicking on a subject term, you can find all articles in the database that have been assigned that term. This can be an alternative way of finding the most relevant articles about that subject. If I wanted to find articles about the application of the Roy adaptation model to Alzheimer's disease, for example, I could start with an advanced search and put in Roy adaptation model as a subject. and choose subject from the select field here, and then simply as a keyword, Alzheimer's disease. This introduction to CINAHL should get you started in exploring one of the core databases in nursing. There is, of course, much more to discover about this wonderful resource. So as questions come up, don't hesitate to ask a librarian.